is intensifying for the person that shot and killed a Bronx woman while she sat in a parked car earlier this month. News 12's Noel Lilly is at that scene where it happened to tell us what the latest is. Noel, good morning. Good morning, guys. Police have released new video of what they believe may have been the getaway car that one of the shooters took off in on the night that Sally Natim was killed. Take a look at this video. You can see what appears to be a black car turn the corner of what looks like Morris Avenue. Police think this car is connected to that shooting on April 12th. Around 8 p.m. that day, cops say two men started shooting at each other on Sheraton Avenue near McClellan Street. In their surveillance video that we've shown you before, you can see one of the alleged shooters casually walking down the street when he stops to pull out a gun, then runs toward a group of people standing near the crosswalk and starts firing. That's when bullets struck and killed 23-year-old Sally Natim, who police say was simply sitting in the passenger seat of a parked car. She was hit in the head and died from her injuries. And the memorial here for Sally Natim has just continued to grow and grow. Candles, balloons, and signs laid down on the ground. But police are still looking for the alleged shooters responsible for her death. And anyone who has information is asked to contact police. In Concourse Village, Noelle Lilly, News 12.